go. What's going on folks at home? We're coming to you from TD's Fine Furniture in Summerton, Alabama. And behind us, you know it, you Googled it, it's here, Magnolia Manor. It's probably one of the hottest things that's came to furniture, especially in the bedroom industry, in a long time. That's exactly right. We have it in stock, on display, and on sale. We're not going to go over prices in this video today because we don't want to make all the dealers across the country look bad because I'm sure, as Justin just said, if you yep. just Google this group, you want to see it, you'd like to touch it, which we you can if you come in store, but we are going to do our best today to show you this group and take away all the questions that you could have um, in making a decision. That's right. And with a collection so large, uh, we're grateful here at TD's to have a showroom big enough to be able to show almost every single piece that you can get from their bedroom collections. Um, so John, if you'll just pan that way, I want you to see probably my favorite bed out of the whole group. It's something that when people come in, if you jump on it, if you shake it, that headboard ain't got no shaking because I'm telling you, this beautiful all upholstered sleigh, I mean, it is a tank. I mean, check out how thick that footboard is along with those rails and that headboard. It has got some size, so it is great for anybody who's shaking the bed. This group right here, you guys, the fabric it's super neutral. It's got some gray, it's got some linen, it's got some beige. So really any kind of comforter set, any kind of bedding set you want to put on this bed, it will blend. Now this fabric blends with this wood top, I mean perfectly, and that's what they were going for there. Now with this bed, two of the beds that they offer, actually three, will have upholstered on them. The other bed in the collection is just straight up paint. So pretty much. <laughs> yeah. Um, so if you want upholstered, this is what you're going to get. And we've put every color comforter on it. You can imagine. Um, and it's always looked great. This neutral one right here, to be honest with you, it just sells more beds. So that's why it's on here. That's right. Um, but uh, of course, you know, with beautiful beds, you got to have some good looking case pieces. Um, I know they have a bedside chest, a one drawer nightstand, a two drawer nightstand, dresser, mirror, chest, you name it. It literally has it, okay? John, behind you is probably my favorite piece because it offers a little bit of everything when you're talking about quality and uh, a lot of storage, okay? So, humongous, okay? I think I got my tape measure on me. This guy, he's like 36 inches long. He is 18 inches deep, and this thing is pretty tall. That's why they call it a bachelor's chest for, it, it's for any guy any guy that's got, of course, their junk drawer down there in the bottom, cedar lined. I mean, these things are top notch, but the best thing about it, okay, besides the AccuGlide drawer glides, the English dovetail on the back, and the French in the front, is the fact that it has USB charging ports right there in the back, easy charge. If you got that short iPhone charger, well, guess what? It's right there by your bedside. That's right. All right, John, come over here. Let's show them this dresser right here. Now, um, as Justin just said, you have felt lined top drawers every time. And then you're also going to have that cedar lined bottoms. Um, as he said really quickly, uh, but we just want to reiterate this, you have French dovetail in the front and then an English dovetail in the back. Almost a full extension drawer, so it's got great quality here. And then a lot of people, as before we continue navigating through this group, uh, there's also a couple of other manufacturers who make a very similar group. Now, one of them that I think Liberty may have stolen the idea from is Hooker. It's the Sanctuary Group. That will be in the comments below that will link to our website, and you can check that group out. It is a little bit more expensive, um, but the quality and the features, it just takes it up a whole nother notch and a whole nother scale um, of what you can do with this group. It's absolutely gorgeous. You should definitely check that out after you get done watching this video. Justin, what are you laying on? What's up, man? Hey, if you don't like sleeping in your bed, this bed bench is actually really good for tying your shoes or sleeping. Uh, if you don't have uh, laces, then, well, it's great for putting your sandals on, too. Uh, but this thing is absolutely gorgeous, so maybe not so much on the all-upholstered sleigh, because, well, technically, like I said, I mean, this thing is absolutely awesome. You can get it. You can use this part as a bed bench. But if you got a little bit bigger of a backside, this is kind of a small area, so bed bench would be great for you. Or in one in front of the panel beds, or just add a little bit of some upholstery inside of your room. It's a great way to do it. Um, TJ, what you got, man? What you, what you, what you All got? All right, let's show them another bed. This bed right here is our number one selling bed. Um, 
the upholstered sleigh, we love it. But to be honest with you, the majority of our customers love this one the most. Um, this guy right here, it kind of combines the, um, the all wood as well as the upholstered together to make a baby of this bed right here. Now, let's say you like this bed, but you really just don't like the upholstered. That's okay, that's your opinion. If you don't like it, that's fine. We've got it right behind there. And when you go with no upholster, you get this really cool wooden trim that goes right down to the middle, creates these panels, and it looks amazing. Now, we do have one other bed of the collection on the back side. Yeah, so, so that, and you also have the square panel, don't forget but, about it. But that's not, this is not Magnolia Man. Right, it just looks like, I mean, it's, it's perfect with the group. I mean, the coloring is absolutely phenomenal. But, okay, if upholstered sleigh is not your, if, if it's just not your thing, and shaking the bed is, well, you get, two shaking beds and not upholstered okay shaking bacon shaking bacon or shaking beds here at td's we got it all okay but this guy right here absolutely beautiful wood trim as tj said it's kind of got like some dividers so like a his or her uh side of the bed so like it kind of has a line right down the middle you'll know which side's yours or your wife's well every every side's your wife's let's be honest uh but another real thick frame i mean this guy is absolutely beautiful um, I can't say much about it, but it's just awesome. Yeah, but let's say your child needs a twin size Magnolia Manor bed, yeah. and it's a funky room, get them the day bed. This thing right here is awesome, you guys. It's got the upholstered headboard. You've got that same great woodwork trim that the big bed has right over there. And it also has a trundle option that pulls out and you can put, um, I don't know, I had no because uh, you can either use it for storage or you can put a mattress in there, which gives you a whole nother place for another person to sleep. That's right. And one thing that people absolutely love about big bedroom groups are bedroom groups that have media chests, okay? Because a lot of people, they try to put a bigger TV on top of a chest. Well, chests are a little too tall, but this allows you to get, you know, maybe like that 55 inch TV inside of your bedroom. It looks great, but it also offers a little bit of some functionality because you got, if you come back here, you see that there's a little hole right there so you can run your cords. It also has the drop down so that of course, if you got any kind of components or anything that has that infrared lighting that you have to, you know, point your remote right at, you have easy access and it is perfect for your bedroom. Yep, and one other thing we wanna mention, there is another group, it's called the Ray Lane by Ashley. That group was the one that copied this group and it's gonna be a cheaper price point than this one. So right. if you need a more high-end look, you could go with the Sanctuary by Hooker, which will be in the comments yep. down below, which you also wanna click, send you our website, and then you can talk to John about anything you wanna know. Then you also see a link for the Liberty Magnolia Manor, which is behind us, which is that mid price point. And then you have the Ashley Rayland, which is the much cheaper version. Case pieces are a little bit smaller. It doesn't have quite as many features as this one. Right. Um, but still great for a budget. Yep. Um, it's, a, it's, it's a good looking group as well. We don't stock that one, um, but this one right here, it is the bomb. Anything else you wanna say about this, Justin? No, I mean, it's just one of those things that if you want to see this collection, you got to come and see us because I know we're one of the only dealers in Alabama that has pretty much everything that goes with it. Um, because we have the dining, we have the bedroom, we have the occasionals. I mean, we have, oh, even home office. I mean, it's one of those things, if you like this collection and the grouping, just the overall coloring, whatever you like about it, come and see us. We're in Summerton, Alabama. That's right. Also, if this is your first time logging onto the channel, be sure to subscribe to that. Subscribe. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video. Um, we hope it was helpful. Drop us a comment if there's anything you want us to review later on in future videos. We're going to be posting these every Friday. So anytime you want to know anything about furniture, think of us, TJ and Justin's Facebook page or uh, no. YouTube channel. <laughs> but YouTube. we also are on Facebook um, at TD's Fine Furniture. We're going to plug it Facebook, Instagram, and now Twitter. Make sure you come in, subscribe, like, follow, whatever you got to do on whichever channel you're looking at. And it's just content that comes more regular. Uh, we post, I mean, probably about 15 pictures a day between every single one of them. And that's on the low side of things. Thank you guys for watching. I'm not going to say anything else. Subscribe to the channel. Share the video. Drop us a comment. We'll see you later. See ya.